We're live here at the one-of-a-kind Empire Fight Camp. Alongside me is Johnny Nelson. I feel like a fraud. How have I got these ringside seats? It's time for our tale of the tape. Introducing first, it's Riddick Big Daddy Bo. Six foot five, 240 pounds with a reach of 81 inches. And up against him, it's Larry Holmes. Six foot three inches tall, weighed in at 226 pounds and has an 81 inch reach. What a weight difference. These two fighters are going to be in deep water. One has a size, has a weight behind it. The other is small, shorter, much, much lighter. Got to be fast, got to be sharp. Otherwise, you're out of there. Riddick. Big Daddy Bo, despite being six foot five inches tall, one of the best inside fighting heavyweights there's ever been. Eastern assassin Larry Holmes, the man that beat Muhammad Ali but never has really gotten his just due, criminally underrated. Let's see what he's got in store for us in this one. Look at this, these fires are so up for it. Look at that. This bout is scheduled for 12 rounds of boxing. In the red corner from Brooklyn, New York, here is the Olympic silver medalist and the two-time unified heavyweight champion of the world, introducing Big Daddy Riddick Bo. Fighting out of the blue corner from Easton, Pennsylvania, here is one of boxing's all-time greats, the heavyweight champion of the world, known as the Easton Assassin, introducing Larry Holmes. Usually you don't need a weather report for a boxing match, but we certainly do today as we fight under the sun. You can't beat a good old-fashioned rivalry. When there's guts, when there's feeling, when there's heart involved, that's when you get a good fight, one-on-one. -on -one. What a great venue, and what a great matchup. Cannot wait for this one. We're hoping for an all-action slugfest. The right hook misses. Someone's will will cave, but which fighter will it be? He just can't land that punch. An open air outdoor stadium. What a venue for this contest. So Todd, let me explain to you. We are outside. Nobody can turn the temperature down. Nobody can turn the sun down. When that sun's beating on you, when you're tired, when you're frustrated, when you get hit, when you get hurt, there's no cool fan that's dropping in there. This is where it's real fighting. Fight one fight. Continues to touch him up. Fight like Roy Jones Jr. now, bouncing on the toes. Those counter punches have to hurt. This slugger has a unique mentality, doesn't he, Johnny? He just wants to win by knockout. He says if we go to the scorecards, it's a failure for me. With sluggers, you cannot let them get into a rhythm because this is how they train. This is how they prepare for fight. This is what they'll do all night. Do not dance their dance. You've got to use speed. Can they figure out the combination to this safe? Skill for skill, tap for tap. Just like a match made in heaven. Through the uppercut, but did not score. Looks like a little change of strategy here. Trying to loosen up the flow a little bit. Counter punches have to hurt. Only catching air with that hook. And that 
was it. That was the big shot we were waiting for. A wise veteran move there to clinch. What a nightmare. And Larry Holmes goes down. And you can see it right here. That body shot sent him down, and they weren't getting up. Even I've got to see that again. Where did that come from? One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's talk about Bo in that last round. That'll be a 10-8 round for sure with the knockdown. Love the response, though. Got back up, took a deep breath, and thought, right. They ring the bell, and here we go. They really got banged up last round. What can they do here to change the momentum? Todd, listen to me. If I knock somebody down like that, that round, you know this round could be... Oh, my. That's a game changer. How did they survive that? Bing Days now needs to steady the pace. Get the pace back to normal. The building is going bananas. Will they see a huge upset here? Keeping those gloves up, the guard high, paying dividends as it seems that that moment of trouble has passed. What recovery skills they are. What a shot it was. So much for defensive abilities. It somehow weathered the storm. Got caught sleeping on the job. What you do, you step back, steady yourself, recompose yourself, then boom, back into it. But do not make those mistakes. And we may see an early stoppage here. It appears he's out of trouble, at least for now. But that just goes to show you, one clean punch changes everything. Defense, defense, defense is everything because they got shot once. They know they can get caught again. So for now, just defense. Will the, Will the referee step in? And they're down. It looks like this one's going to be over. A big headshot, and he goes down. We have got to see that again in slow motion. Shot from the gods, they say. A shot from the gods. So this fight will continue, but how can they get back into this bout? That is a show of character. When you're put down, your ego's hurt, your chin's hurt, your body's hurting, and you've got to get up, suck it up, and think right, I'm back. They're in trouble! Just one punch away from getting the momentum back. Now they've got to wake up. They've got to get on the back foot, clear the head a little bit, then jump back into it. We're always looking for that KO, and we can see an upset right here. Oh, that changes everything, and down they go! I need to see that again. Some amazing boxing right there. I've got to see that again. One, two, three. Final 10 seconds here, and this has not been his round for sure. Beautiful counter punch. Let's talk about Bo in that last round. They get one minute between rounds. This fighter wished it was 10 minutes. And there's the bell to start the round. Last round was a disaster. What can they do here to turn this around? I have no idea what they have left. What? How? How do you come back from something like that? Twice? Where's your head at? Where's your energy levels at? It tells you you've got nothing left. Big Daddy in trouble! How is... Larry Holmes is going down and he's got to get up! And look at that body shot. They couldn't have thrown it any better. You're right, Todd. What a shot. One, two, three, four, five.
How about that will to win and refusal to stay down as this fight continues? He's got to waste time. Get step behind the referee. When he comes in close, tie him up. The referee's then got to power you. Walk around the ring. He's just down goes Larry Holmes. That body shot right there paralyzed him and won him the fight. Where did that come from? What a shot. One, two, three, four, five. Well, he's on his feet, but there's no way he's gonna win this round now. What well, now is about getting back to the corner, freshen up, get new instructions given to you, and they've got to G you up. They've got to tell you what you're doing wrong and what you're doing right. Halfway through the round, and I think we all know who's winning here. No doubt at all. You can see who's... Can they finish it? Well, it's a smart move to clinch, but you can't do that too often. There's a tactic to clinch. Oh, my, the big fella just got rocked. And the referee will begin the count. Ten seconds to get up. I don't see any movement here. It looks like this one's going to be over. As you can see, it was a hit to the head that did it. Let's watch it again. I need to see that again. One, two, three, four, five. So it's onward and upward after another knockout win here. Accuracy, power, punch, perfect. That must hurt.